Hello everyone and welcome back to the Code Vein series. So in today's video we're here in the park ruins and we're actually supposed to go and fight the boss down there. It's the flower boss. That's the lady that she came out of a flower and she like floats around and has a lot of poison stuff. So looking at my character, do I look stronger? I do. And that's because I mean while editing these videos and getting them ready for like YouTube and social media, I have been going around doing some down. farming in different areas doing some dungeon missions as well i am currently at level 31 yeah it's level 31 so we're just gonna beat this boss real quick and then just get through this area yeah that guy is actually good with parries so we gotta be careful of him I don't have to go down that way because I already got what's down there and I mean like it's not that important so this is the boss right here she should have something for me I think it's gone but you know let's get prepared That's super wide range. Don't worry, I got some tricks as well. I think I got poison, but I'll be fine. That attack is always so ridiculous. Alright, we need to finish her. The poison is actually the most annoying part with this fight. I'm not going to die before her. I refuse to. There we go. Butterfly of Delirium. That was pretty fun. You awake? You? I remember you. Where's the girl? Answer me! Where did you take her? We're taking custody of the girl. That human belongs to us. We will take her back. Humans aren't property. They have the same right to live that any of us do. Don't give me that noble act. They have no rights. And why shouldn't we feed on them? We're the ones keeping them safe, after all. Why were we kicked out of our graves? Who did we die for, again and again, at the Queen's hand? We writhe with this terrible thirst. We live in fear of joining the ranks of the lost. And for whose sake? It's all in the service of humans. If blood is the only price they have to pay, then they have a pretty good deal. That doesn't mean you can just do whatever you want with them. And what about the rights of revenants? Huh? It's not like we're choosing to live this way because it's such a barrel of laughs. That should be enough to get you through a month or so. Whoa, whoa, hold on a minute. Just make sure that you and I never cross paths again. This is your one and only warning. No way. The Crimson Sword? Uh, 
I guess we'll be rationing for a while. Oh well. What is lost can be found again, huh? I swear I'll end it. The Revenant's suffering must end. Well, that was pretty entertaining. I can't believe I killed that woman and I didn't get a lot of blood haze. I just got a few. Alright. There's a path here. Deeper inside. I only hope she's all right. Okay, we can trace the flow of the blood beads from here. Just a sec. Give me a moment to finish this, then we can head out. Our destination is this way. This should get us there. We set? All right then. I know you're there. What are you? Stay back! I'm the one who decides how I live! I won't listen to you anymore! That's fine. Just put down the knife. I'm sick and tired of it! Day after day, having my blood sucked by every passing revenant! I'm not an animal! Yes, you are. You're right. And we can help you. I know someone who can take you to one of the government shelters for humans. If you ask, they'll take you in and you'll be able to live in safety. What? You won't have to spend your days living in fear of revenants anymore. Although you will be asked to donate blood. It's... it's a trick. Do you really think I'm going to fall for that? Everything you need to know is on that paper. You're the one who decides how you live. But why? I think the time for sacrifices is over. That's all. All right, we should hurry. Revenants were the same. But I guess there are guys like you out there too, huh? Sorry about earlier. I'll try to be more positive about the shelter. Thanks for helping me out. The rest is up to her. Let's continue our search. Oops. I didn't <laughs> I didn't think that would happen. Sorry, Louis. You'll have to catch your next one. Set these up oh what? There. They'll help us in our business. Okay. I guess he has some tricks up his sleeve that I don't know about. This was all covered by the ocean before the Great Collapse.
This place has changed completely, too. Yeah. Seems like everything's changed since the Great Collapse. The only thing that stayed the same is our appearance. <sighs> Come on. We won't find the source by reminiscing. It's my fault. You say something, Louis? No. Why didn't I? Is this... is this really my... Hey there, hey there Louie. Louis. Are your classes, classes done for the day? Today? Is Cruz awake? She sure, she is. sure is. In fact, in she fact, seems to be in a pretty good mood today, today too. too. Go on Go ahead on and ahead see, her. see her. Here's your visitation pass. Thanks. 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 <laughs> and then, what did the what professor, professor say? say? He said, <clears throat> well, there's no <clears throat> cure like the obscure. <laughs> Another groaner. I hope the experiment is soon. So, so, how are you feeling? I'm fine. I'm fine. Could be worse. Your sister has been taking good care of me, so... Don't worry. I'm the only one who can do it. And I have you and the others watching over me. So I'll be okay. Anyway, enough about that. I want to hear more of your stories from school. Oh, you're here early again, Louie. Is school on a break right now? Yeah. The professors are devoting all their time to research lately. How's Cruz? Well... We're having, We're having a hard, a hard time, time suppressing what's causing, causing the rejection. rejection. Ordinarily, Ordinarily, we wouldn't let you see her. I see. Thanks. Thanks. I appreciate, appreciate it. Does that hurt? Yeah. yeah. Why? Huh? Why does it have to be me? <laughs> Cruz, Cruz, are you okay? okay?
Still not completely sure what happened back then. All I know is that when I finally came to, I was a revenant. I heard a lot of folks died then, but that was real. A genuine memory from my past. From when the Queen. <laughs> from when Cruz frenzied. <laughs> Guess I can't really hide anything from you, huh? Nobody would want to relive that. I couldn't stop Cruz from going into a frenzy. So many people lost their lives including my sister. I wanted to forget my frailty. But, if we can find the source and ensure a stable supply of blood beads, then revenants will be freed from their thirst. Once that happens, there will no longer be any need for Silva's levy system, and humans and revenants will finally be able to live together in peace. I'm going to take responsibility for my past. I think it's the least I can do. Then stop talking about it. Let's get it done. Are we ending this nightmare or what? You can't charge forward if you're always looking back. Yeah, I know. everyone that was a pretty interesting thing from Louis Pass I'm gonna stop this one here thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video